Turning our attention now to the ASX, here's Matt Burney and Bulls and Bears with the latest public company views and interviews. Welcome to Bulls and Bears, brought to you today by Gold Focused Explorer Oraman Limited, ASX code AUN. I'm Matt Burney and I'm joined now by the Managing Director of Oraman, Brad Velukas. Hi Brad. Hi Matt, great to be talking. Okay, so Brad, you recently picked up Middle Island Resources Sandstone Gold Project in WA and it seems your very first outing with the drill rig has seen some success. What were the best drill numbers from your very first campaign? At Sandstone. Matt, we've just gotten results back from our first deep diamond hole at the moment. 344 metres at 1.29 grams, so we're super pleased with that, starting from around 240 metres below the surface. There's some good areas of better grade in there as well. We kick off with 40.9 metres at 2, 21.8 at 2, 16.1 at 2.9, 19.3 at 2, and 22.2 at 2.5 to finish off on the hanging wall contacts. Very pleased. Okay, so looking at this project, it looks like it might potentially be both an open pit and underground. Tell me about these sort of open pit side of it. Have you got a resource around that at this point in time? Matt, directly above Two Mile and also the Shillington Pit just 100 metres to the south. We've got a combined resource 4.3 million tonnes at 1.1 grams for 157,000 ounces and then there's another nine small open pit resources as well. Alright, tell me about the total resource at Sandstone, underground and open pit. Total resource is 22 million tonnes at 1.1 for 784,000 ounces and in addition to that we've got another 800,000 tonnes at 2.1 for uh, 65,000 ounces just to the south at our Johnson Range deposit. Now looking at your maps I see a banded iron formation that looks like it cuts straight through your main mineralised zone almost up to surface. Is there any gold in that? There's some awesome results there. 18.5 at 6.7, 29 at 15 and and 24.8 at 17.6 and we've actually drilled into that as well trying to trace that further to the south in between that two mile and Shillington deposit. Now I know there's an old mill on site at this project. What would it take to fire that up again? It really depends on, on scale but there's options there from probably around $20 million but we're in a great starting position. There's existing foundations, a whole lot of supporting infrastructure, offices, camps in town, ball fields, build up ROM pad, and permits, of course, as well, in the existing mining list. So, really good position to start from. Brad Belukas from Oraman, thanks for joining me on Bulls and Bears today. And remember, we're only here to give you information, not advice, which you should, of course, seek independently. I'm Matt Burney, and this is Bulls and Bears. For more public company CEO interviews, go to the money page on the 6PR, 2GB, and 3AW websites and click the Public Companies tab.